Episode Story Number 2 Niffle and the Lost Dream In Niffle's cosy, dimly lit underground cavern, the shelves are lined with thousands and thousands upon glowing glass bottles, each containing a different dream. Niffle, a tiny creature from the dream world with twinkling eyes and iridescent skin, flirts nervously around the room, checking each bottle of his underground home. Oh dear, oh dear, where did you go? Can't do the dream, oh no, that would be dreadful. Niffle stops in front of an empty shelf, tapping his chin thoughtfully. Hmm, a dream of grand adventures killing someone. Who is it for? Ah, yes. Niffle feels that it's for a young boy. Little Timmy, he must be so sad about his dream, poor Timmy. Niffle quickly grabs his book of dream records, flipping through the pages with tiny trembling fingers. <laughs> Let's see, Timmy's dream, Timmy's dreams. I have found it. Now to retrieve him before they get lost and the first glare of the morning light appears. Niffle grabs an empty bottle, closes his eyes and concentrating really hard. Within an instant, he teleports to Timmy's bedroom, where Timmy is still asleep, and the first light of dawn is soon on the way. Niffle tiptoes around the room, searching for Timmy's dream to appear so he can keep it safe for him. Where could you be, little dream? Hiding from Niffle, are you? No one hides from Niffle for long. He spots a faint, shimmering glow under Timmy's bed. He tiptoes over silently, and with a mischievous grin, Niffle sits on the floor with a glass bottle in between his legs and waits for the dream to fill the bottle so he can contain it. Soon, the energy starts to fill the bottle, but not all of it. Niffle lets some of the dream energy flow into the bottle to keep for next time. Closes the lid. Oh, there you are. Naughty dream, running away like that. Back to the cavern with you. While keeping the rest of the dream active in Timmy's bedroom until the first light of dawn. <laughs> Sweet dreams, Timmy, enjoy your grand adventure. With a quick glance around to make sure no one sees him, Niffle closes his eyes and quickly teleports back to his cavern. He places the now glowing bottle back on the shelf with the others, breathing a sigh of relief. Oh, oh that was close one. He moves swiftly and silently, always keeping an eye out to ensure he isn't seen. The cavern glows softly with the light of countless dreams, each one a precious memory stored safely by the quirky, shy, mischievous Niffle. Do, 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 do.